Hello, my name is Maria and this is Matthew, my mascot. In this lesson we're going to study adding on a number line. Here's an example. These little red and blue things are arrows, like little jumps. Imagine, for example, like a rabbit making a little jump from 0 to 1, another little jump from 1 to 2, and then so on. So many little jumps. And then we are going to write an addition from all this jumping. So, first of all, all those red ones, there are four little jumps, right? So I write four. Then we add two more little jumps, right? The blue ones, two more little jumps. Four plus two. And then where do we end up after all this jumping on the number line? We are at six, or the rabbit is at six. What's that, Matty? Oh, you don't like the rabbit jumping. You want to go jumping. Shall we let Matthew jump on the number line? Let's see how. How will he do? You're erasing my arrows, Matthew. Like it? Sure. Okay, let's go here. 2 plus 5 and draw the arrows for Matthew or Rabbit or Cricket to jump on the number line. 2 means first I draw 2 jumps. Two little jumps. Five means I draw five more jumps. And where are we? We are at seven. So that's the answer. Seven. Again, first six jumps. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then four jumps more. One, two, three, four. And we are at ten. Six plus four equals ten. Over here, things are different. Now, instead of many little jumps, all those little jumps are made into one single arrow. One arrow. This one arrow means actually three little jumps. Okay? It goes from zero to three. So, we are adding three. And then the blue arrow. How many little jumps is it? How many units is it? One, two, three, four, Five, six. It is six little jumps. Six. And where do we end up? At nine. Three plus six equals nine. Over here, first I have like a one jump, one unit. And then I have over here one, two, three, four, five little jumps making this one single arrow. One plus five. And we end up at six. Let's try over here. Draw, instead of little jumps, I'm going to draw arrows for 2 plus 8. So my first arrow is like two jumps long, too long, like that, right? And my second arrow should be 8 long, so let me figure out how far it goes. Like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. It has to go all the way to 10, from here to 10, and then it is 8 units or 8 jumps long. 4 plus 4. My first arrow will be 4 jumps long. 1, 2, 3, 4, of course, till 4, right? And the second one, 4 long too, so it goes from like 1, 2, 3, 4, all the way to 8. Okay. And if you find these arrows a little difficult, and you have a problem like this, then just draw the little jumps for your rabbit or for Matthew or your cricket. And the answers, oops, forgot to write 10 here and 8 here. Now some word problems. Julie saw five shoes near the door. Now mom found three more shoes in the kitchen. Does that ever happen in your house? Shoes are scattered. How many shoes are there in total? Five near the door, three in the kitchen. So we can add, I will write an addition. Five plus three equals eight. Eight shoes in total. Matthew owns five basketballs. Do you like playing basketball? Sure, he likes basketball. But today he can only find one. Is your house messy too, Matthew? How many are missing? Five basketballs, but he can only find one. How many are missing? I will write how many more additions. He has one that he can find. And then if he finds those missing ones, right? If he finds those missing ones, then he will have five, or five. So how many are missing? One plus how many would make five? 
Four, right. Good job. Lastly, we have here some problems where a number line can help us. What's that, Matthew? Can he go jumping on the number line again? No, not this time, Matthew. We can't take time for that all the time. Eight plus one. Imagine that you are at eight. Over here. Plus one means you jump one more from eight to nine. That's easy. Now, if you're here at eight and you jump two more, you're at eight, you jump two more, you go to ten. If you're at eight and you jump three more, you go to this number. If you don't know what that number is, it's called 11. There was a little pattern here. 1, 2, 3, 9, 10, 11. 10 plus 1. You are 10 and you jump 1. So you go to 11. You are 10 and you jump 2 more. 12. And what's this last one? If you know these numbers, it is 13. And we have the same pattern here. 1, 2, 3, 11, 12, 13. Just one more each time. Okay, we're all done with this lesson.